Hello everyone, this is Iqbal and now we will continue the road. In the last episode, we opened the safe, and in the safe was this box. These three seals stand between me and the contents of this box. Classic. Look for the right angle and you see the right number. Two and six. It's a tiny switch that opens quite a big thing. Mm, yes. I'm trying to go through this pretty fast because I took this video once but it was so long that it would have taken like 5 or 6 hours maybe even to upload. I didn't really like that idea. Here's a key. It looks like it's winning up Clockwork. And we will see this same later. Don't worry, we will not miss out the story parts. And we will slow down on those. Don't worry. Light it up and pull it up. Now let's see what this one has to say. It's a part of the story. February 11th. My research continues at a snail's pace. With these barbaric instruments, I can barely read anything at all. But there is something there. Between earth and fire, between water and air, I cannot see it, but I can see its presence. Like the shadow of the object without substance, yet betraying the shape and form of that which casts it. It is the final element, null. It brings meaning to the rest, just as all the numbers of the world are meaningless without their zero. The circle are petty fools, blinded by the dark arts and their greed. Alchemy is not the pursuit of callow gold. It is the pursuit of this. Now let's see it through. The telescope. There is someone. And the box. I get the feeling there's more than to that than I saw. Would the eyepiece reveal anything? Let's see. It sir looks different. Trial. Trial. The brass plate with the letter L. Do you see that symbol? It's important. Like that, that, and that there. A heavy cast iron key. 
we will need that later. One of the seals opened, two more, and I'll be in. That's a big safe. But first, let's look at part of the story. May 8th, McAllister returns with the rabbis from Egypt. The pattern continues. The titans call the null element space. To the Hindus, it's other. And now, to the Babylonians, it is simply up, the other direction, the realm of Ishtar. Of yet more significance, significance is the recurring presence of the hexagonal glyph. This symbol. The same symbol repeated in cultures separated by countless centuries and the span of the globe. Who will tell me now that this is idle superstition at work? When my hands hold the first distilled sample, they will recognize me then. Presently, the skeptics have one more in their number. McAllister has quit my service. Strange little orbs. Now they all are little. Here is the symbol. Classic right angle reveals the thing. Dear, this is a big key. <laughs> Key that takes you another key. <laughs> um, I find that really funny. An enameled brass star. Here's a star. Here's another part of the story. June 21st. Take note of this date. It is the most significant in human history. I have done it. A human subject was required. Subject. The catalyst was my own being. Fatigued by my studies, I entered the chamber without disabling the mechanism. When I regained consciousness, I had succeeded. The null element is beyond curious, being neither quite energy nor matter, energy. I have already made great strides in its study specifically in how it reflects the light. Tonight, I open the wine. Bra a brass ring with markings around the edge. Two on the left, and five on the right. Another key. A large, oddly shaped key. The key doesn't fit like this. Circular plate with a star emblem. The second seal is open. Just one more to go. What's this? 
clockwork. Turn the lever. Missing parts should face the drawer, and I need to find them. We need to find them and put them in the right shape. Now we can open the drawer. An elastic band, a large cog, turn the lever, and what's this? A small screwdriver. Time to do some unscrew. Peculiar folding key. This is the best keyhole I have ever seen. It's the wrong shape. Well, it was the wrong shape, not anymore. Medium sized cock. It feels like I can take this off again if I need to. Turn the lever. A medium sized cock. A little bit of engineering, and the third is on. Let's push the button. A long, narrow steel tube. Tube. Some kind of small key. An old photograph. Six oh five. Uh, I usually say that zero o when it's a time. There we go. Thank you. An oval gemstone. And let's set the time to six oh five or six zero five. To say it that way. This was the second chapter of the room, and next time we will go to chapter 3. This is Ippa, thank you for watching, and see you in the next video.